Hi, this is Nigel from Mad About Animals. In this session, I'd like to talk about betting on horse racing, dog racing, and other such things. You bet they die. Maybe you've heard that before. It's used quite often in terms of horse racing, greyhound racing, that sort of thing, as in those sports are notoriously bad for the animals involved. There are other sports involving animals, of course, but those are the two main ones, certainly in the UK. You bet they die. As I record this, in the UK there is a horse race going on called the Grand National, which is taking place today. Undoubtedly, some horses will fall. It's notorious for horses falling at the jumps, and very, very, very often horses are killed because they break a leg or some other injury that's just not economically viable to rehabilitate the horse so they serve their useful purpose so they're shot often just shot there and then they put a screen on them of course because they don't want us to see what's happening and they'll lie about it they'll say oh well the horse was uh, in such pain and agony that it was the kindest thing. Well, you know what? The kindest thing is to not ride them in the first place, not make them jump over massive jumps in the first place. If you didn't get on their back and ride them, then they wouldn't do that jump and they wouldn't get hurt. So yeah, you bet they die. I love lots of sports. I'm a football fan. I love cycling, a keen skier. But there are other sports that I'm not so keen on, things like cricket, tennis, boxing even. What have all those sports got in common? They're all done by consenting humans. I went to those sports knowing what the risks are. Even something like boxing, where people suffer brain hemorrhages and all that sort of thing. Even in football, people are suffering brain hemorrhages from hitting the ball too often. And yes, we didn't know about the risks. <laughs> 20, 30, 40 years ago when those people were doing it. But we do now. And people still go into those sports and participate in those sports knowing full well what they're letting themselves in for. They are willing participants. Dogs and horses and other animals that are involved in sport are not willing participants. That's the difference. You bet they die. I've been Nigel from Mad About Animals. If you've enjoyed this, please like, share and subscribe and watch out for our next video. Thank you.